Hello, welcome to Home Cooking with Song Jit. Today I'm going to cook stir fry bitter cod with minced pork and salted black bean paste. I have one medium sized bitter cod or bitter melon. Wash, remove the seed, and cut it into bite size just like this. And I have three cloves of garlic chopped, half teaspoon of pepper, one tablespoon of salted black bean paste, half tablespoon of light soy sauce, half teaspoon of thick soy sauce, quarter teaspoon of sesame seed oil, half teaspoon of Shing wine or Chinese cooking rice wine, about one cup of minced pork, one tablespoon of salt, and I will be using some water for cooking as well. So for the bitter cod or bitter melon, they are quite bitter. So before I cook, I like to wash it with salt just to rinse away the bitterness of the bitter taste. Although we cannot remove all, but we just wash it with salt so it helps a little bit so that children can eat as well. I'm going to use all the salt to wash, um, to rub with the bitter cod. And then we will go and wash it away with water. I'm going to use this basin. I'm going to pour all of this. And then just, just rub. Alright, just rub a little bit and then I will rinse it with water. We'll rinse a few times so we we'll make sure that we rinse away all the salt and the bitterness taste. Alright, bitter cod is rinsed very well to make sure that there's no more salt stuck into the bitter cod. I rinse about 5 to 6 times, so the bitter cod is a bit bruised now. Okay, um, next I'm going to marinate the meat. Just put meat in the bowl. I'm going to put just a little of the light soy sauce from here. And about half of the pepper from here and just marinate them okay then we can go and cook it heat the pan I'm going to put in about one tablespoon of cooking oil wait for the oil to heat up and then we will fry the garlic okay I'm going to put in the garlic We'll fry until the garlic turn brown and fragrant. Alright, garlic is brown. I'm going to remove half of it from the pan. Just going to remove it, half of it. Okay, we put aside and left some of the garlic and the oil in the pan. I'm going to pour in the meat now. Fry until the meat is cooked. So I just add a little bit of oil just now because the pan is quite dry. Alright, the meat is cooked. Now I'm going to, go to put in the bitter cut. Stir fry. So I'm going to put in a little bit of water, about quarter cup of water, and then I'm going to put in all the ingredients, pepper, light soy sauce, sesame seed oil, salted black bean, and dark soy sauce. Put a bit water so it is easy to dilute. Okay, just mix them. So I'm going to add a bit more water because we need to cook until the bitter cod is soft. Because for myself, I like the bitter cod to be soft a bit. I don't want to eat it uh, like very hard to bite. So I'm going to cover the lid. Let it cook for about five minutes. Oh, it's boiling now. Wow. The bitter cod is soft. 
bitter cut is soft already so um, yeah five minutes pass I'm going to taste it wow really nice a bit bitter but the gravy is delicious so it's cooked already so I'm going to put in the Chinese cooking wine this is tapioca flour water. I forgot about this ingredient just now. This is a uh, half tablespoon of tapioca flour with three tablespoon of um, water. So I'm going to just put in only half. You just want to make the gravy thicken. That's it. Very nice and lovely. I'm going to switch off the heat. That's done. Those who appreciate bitter cod, this is really an idea dish. It looks so yummy. Oh my goodness. This is lovely. Pour over the garlic. It is very delicious. The bitter cod that is not too bitter. It blends very well with the salted black bean paste and make overall the gravy taste very delicious. This one is really nice to eat with rice. I give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe for more of my cooking video like this. Thank you and bye bye.